your old buddy Michael Shapir playing Trains 2022 Plus Standard Edition. And this is the Tidewater Point route. <laughs> Episode 71. I don't know why I said it that way. It just kind of came out that way. I, I, don't, I don't know. Whatever. All right. So uh, we are going to start off with Jeff here. Jeff is in River Point Yard. He's our shunter over here with his SW 1500. And he just has to shunt these two cars here that you can see are on our this is way over there, River Point inbound track. Here's a train waiting to get in to uh, River Point as well. Okay, so let's uh, let's have him hook up here. Uh, here we go. Perfect. And now let's have him back up. These are going to Tidewater out. And of course, the question is: is what track is that? Is that like track seven or eight? Uh, let's see. Yards uh, in River Point. Uh, Tidewater is going to be uh, six. Track six. All right. So what do we what do we got over here now? Is there any room on track six? There's track seven right there. All right. Track eight. So this is track six right here. Yeah. Uh, track six is wide open. There's nobody on track six. Alrighty then. Sounds good. Uh, we'll throw this one this way. And turn this one back to normal as well. And let's bring it forward now, shall we? Here he comes. It's a real quick shunt job for him here. way it works. Sometimes you get a long cut, sometimes you get a short cut. There we go. Stop it right. Well, now, come on. It went off and it came back on again. Don't do me like that. All right, so we'll go this way, and then we're going to go over here to track six. Back it up. Go oh, there we go. We'll back it up past this switch. Back it up on this track past this switch on the track over. Maybe in a little bit further. Maybe a little bit further. Here he comes. That'll do. Apply the handbrake. Decouple. There we go. That magnificent uh, set of moves there was Jeff's entire turn. Uh, so let me put you guys back on pause, and uh, or put you on pause for the first time, I guess, uh, until I figure out what's going on next. So now we're here with Sean on the Tidewater Dock. Now, some of my viewers have been uh, saying that I'm scared to come down to the Tidewater Dock because of how backed up it is and all the trains we have waiting to get on here. <laughs> That's not true. I'm not scared. I'm terrified. Uh, yeah, it is uh, It is pretty clogged up out here. So what we're going to do is uh, the only two industries he still has to work with down here is Bird's Eye Vegetables, which is right over here. And he's got to work uh, one other one, I thought. Yeah, Tidewater Ethanol, which is right here. Okay, the rest of these cars, he could technically get out of here. Like this big, long stretch of cars here. Uh, these ones are the last three full ones, right? Let's turn on the uh, commodity overlays real quick. Yeah, those are the last three full ones there. Uh, I still got to empty all of these. We can only do two at a time. Uh, boy. So, uh... And the Harley brothers are all done. These are ready to leave. The coal cars over here are ready to leave. These steel cars here are actually Jessica's. She's working that industry, so that's a no-go. All right, so let's uh, let's get things together with the idea that we're going to get rid of a lot of this stuff. 
All right. Now, is there room to push another ethanol car onto here? No, there is not. Okay. So what we're going to do first is we're going to do the ethanol or the uh, <laughs> bird's eye uh, vegetables, which is right here. Uh, so we're just going to bump those cars, bump it back two cars, what we're going to do. All right, so let's back it up. There we go. Should have room, right? Maybe not. I'm hoping there's room. That's going to be real close. Okay, 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 okay. Right there as far as it can go. Uh, that doesn't allow this one to dump here, does it? Shouldn't this track be longer by just a smidge? But it's not. But it's not. So let's uh, let's uh, pull it forward then, and we'll latch it on, then come back. Okay, that's what we're gonna do. There you go. Those two are set correctly. Uh, what am I? This one is set correctly. Yeah, it is. Okay. Here we go. There he goes. What is this? What, what what engine is this? An ES? Whoa, whoa, hey, look at it's Sean. Uh this is an SD80 Mac. Yep, yeah, the SD80 Mac. Okay. Uh now these are all set correctly, right? I'm gonna just come back here and watch back here. Yes. And yes. And then there's Jessica way up the track there. And then this train way over here is also waiting to get into this yard. Are you kidding me right now? This one right here actually is, yeah. No, I'm not. I'm not. I'm not. I'm not. This is not a joke. All right. Uh, here we go. Pull these out. Stick the last two onto this track. Then push these back in. That's what we're doing. And then the rest of these cars that I pull out of here and off the dock area <clears throat> could therefore then be... Uh, Put into the inbound track here in Tidewater and reclassified. Sounds good to me. I like my plan. I'm excited about my plan. I hope you are too. But if you're not, well, this just may not be the channel for you. There we go. This way. All of this is done already. I will back it up. Did I throw that switch? Yeah. Okay. But the dock here is wigging out right here. It's distracting me. All right. So once we latch onto this one here, we'll have to push it back far enough. Probably, yeah. To where this ethanol tanker is sitting currently. Slow down just a bit more. Go you know, just the last two that are empty. There we go. Not right there should do. And we will. Apply the handbrake, tie it down, as they say. We up. All right. Then we'll set these out over the uh, the grill there, the bird's eye vegetables. They can crank out cans of corn.
You know what I'm thinking? I'm thinking of this now. Suddenly in my brain, I'm going like this. Here are steel coils, right? And they're taking them, putting them on. To, you know, we're offloading them onto here. And yet we're making cans of vegetables at bird's eye. Shouldn't these be going in? <laughs> that would make more sense, wouldn't it? It would. We should be offloading these, not onloading them. Of course, this guy is bringing stuff in. Of course, we could be getting it from rail and from trucks. So it looks like they are being offloaded and put onto the cars. But who in the heck would be making steel coils down here? Maybe it's just, maybe no company is. The trucks are bringing it in from the steel track factory to put them on here. Yeah, that's the story we'll go with. Okay, I was going to make a major industry change here, and I decided not to. Talk myself out of it. Because the trucks bring them in, and some of the steel coils go into the bird's eye vegetables, so they do use some steel there. But then the rest has to be carried away by us to points unknown. Okay. And we'll move these last two into position here. A nice shot here. I like it. Watch out. Dole Fruit Dock and Bird's Eye Vegetable Dock Workers. Here we come. I am really tempted to move this track this way just a little bit. Just a tiny bit. To accommodate us pushing cars back there. All right, so that one there is pretty good. What about this one on this side? Oh yeah, we can we can go back this way. As a matter of fact, we pushed it too far. There you go, right there. Okay, yeah. What, what is this guy doing here? Are these like, uh, these are like I beams, aren't they? Yeah, they are. And it looks like he wants to load the I beams onto here, doesn't it? Yes, it does. Yet I don't have an I beam service here now, do I? No, I don't. Could add that, but I think we already got enough. I think we got enough. All right. So now, uh, that one there's a little too close, so we'll, uh, Tie it down here like this. Now pull this forward. There we go. Oh, dips down there because of the water. We'll stop it right here. A little bit of handbrake for you. Got who I was. Remember me? I'm Sean. Yeah. <laughs> there we go. Now let's clear this switch right here. Pretty as you please. What happened? What happened to the cement all of a sudden? Wigged out. All right. I've got to come back here. Latch on to this one. I did, by the way, make a command decision. 
And I've made it so that Jeff and Thomas have fewer turns now. So we don't have quite as many cars coming on to the route. Now I know some of you are hoping that I would uh, completely uh, log jam the entire route are going to be disappointed but well and that's not unusual uh, for me to do that by the way before I, long before I started uh, taping any of this of course I played trains on my own and when I uh, went with new routes I would find that you know I had to adjust the spreadsheet here and there to accommodate whatever's going on on the new uh, the new route Always a work in progress. Yeah, so Jeff and Thomas having fewer turns, that means there'll be fewer trains coming onto the route from the outside. Which will allow me to free up, you know, resources for other things. So that it doesn't become a gridlock. Here we go now. Stick this car here. We're gonna go around this side though. Oh, whoa, 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 don't go, don't do that. This is new here, this wavy, waviness. Alrighty. Like a train has no driver. Oh, yes, it does. Let's go back up here, actually. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Come on, trains. Work with me, buddy. No, no, look at this. Look at look, this. Look, 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 look. There we go. There. Now that I go past this, I did. That's all right. Well, I didn't want to go past this switch right here because I actually want to go down here and grab on all these, but it's it's okay. It's gonna work. It's gonna take some extra moves. this way and then we'll set this ethanol from global into position Those three ethanol tankers we have right there are the last three we have to unload here at uh, Tidewater Ethanol. Here he comes back. Beautiful. There ought to do. Now we will apply. Do that. Wonderful. Everything's beautiful and wonderful. You notice that? And why is that? <laughs> because I'm driving trains. I'm operating trains. That's why. Whoop, no, 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 no. Stop too soon. There you go. Now you got it. Oh, 
Okay. Now uh, we're going to run all these cars, all these empties, back up to uh, the Tidewater inbound track. Because that's how we do. There we go. Okay. Oh, now I got to pull forward. We're on the wrong track. So we clear that switch right there. We want to grab onto this cut right here. Next to the wigging out concrete. Delicious. Got up early this morning, 5 a.m., so I'm a little bit tired. My wife uh, is a pharmacist in a hospital, and she uh, had to get up early this morning. That's why I always get up with her. So I'm a bit tired. Uh, okay, now what we're doing here is we're uh, backing this up to get these boxcars here from the Harley Brothers that have all been... Uh, did we open these doors? No, we did not. Uh, that have all been unloaded already. Or loaded, I forget which. I think it's unloaded. Yeah, it's unloaded. Alrighty. Got it. Now we're going to pull forward. Alright, now what we're going to do... Pull back around here. All these cars still are being serviced. They all have to be dropped off at Bird's Eye. Uh, these two ethanol tankers still have to come back to the dock. And then these two here have to come back to the dock. Am I thinking right? I think I am. Uh, let's see. Yeah, those two are full. Those, These two are full. Yep, and those two are full. So, yes. Yes. Uh, okay. Okay. Now we're going to pull forward. Now, actually, we're going to stop them just before we get to this uh, little level crossing uh, boards here. Because we're going to get uh, Jessica out of the way. There we go. A little bit of auto brake. A little bit of indie brake. Beautiful. Jessica, you're going to get out of the way. We're going to give you mainline permission. Where you at, Jessica? Because when it's her turn next, I want her to be able to start... Getting some of this stuff done. All right, no, you're not going that way. You're going this way. You ready? That means yes, but also means she's pulling forward. Oh, 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 oh. No, 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 no. There we go. Wow, what is she pulling? Are the guys in the caboose dragging their feet? Uh, she's got 28.32. No, the, the guys in the caboose are not dragging their feet. For two reasons. One, uh, they wouldn't do that. And it really wouldn't make a difference anyway. And two, uh, there is no caboose. So, there you go. All right, so we're going to pull her past this right here. Now, there should be enough room for her to fit here, right? Oh, yeah. we got lots of room. Lots and lots of room. Come on back down now. Here she comes. We're just going to move her out of the way temporarily. That's got to be an incline there, right? I mean, she's struggling a bit. Then when we bring Sean up eventually, because he's got to go over here to the Tidewater Yard, the upper the upper yard, 
we'll have him just come over onto this track. And then once he clears this one right here, we can have him back down this way. He'll be all set. At least I think that's where we want to back him down, right? Or is it this near track? Uh, no, it's actually the near track. Not the far track. Okay. Yeah, these are all going to bird's eye vegetables. I mean, those, they got to be working all three shifts down there because this is a lot of vegetables. And then we got yeah, these reefers coming up. Those are all going to the Dole Fruit Dock. Dole is also canning some items in there. These are just like pineapples and pears straight off the trees. Pi pineapples don't grow on trees, right? Pineapples grow off a low-lying bush. Right? <laughs> I think... Then we have these coal cars, which of course are, are, of course, I mean, of course, are going to the Burnside Coal Dock. Sure. Fill the barge. And then this last stretch is all going to Harley Brothers. Get her to get past the switch so she's not fouling out. You don't want to foul out the switch if we don't have to, right? There we go, right there. Perfect. Okay, so when he comes up now, let's set these tracks now. You want him to go over here to this one. Uh yeah, then go this one. This one should be normal. This one should be normal. This one will be uh reversed out that way okay so now we're good with all of that whoa whoa i'm hitting every bush on the way over every tree on the way over we're smacking right into it okay sean the track has been cleared up for you buddy let's go all right so now as i was saying before this ethanol is now being unloaded so we don't want to touch that uh, then there are these, which we don't want to touch either. So the next ones we want to get uh, are going to be down here. Right out here. He's also responsible for these four right here. So we're going to grab these TOFCs. And then when we're done grabbing the TOFCs, we'll back down and grab onto these here and that there. There's the barge. Okay. Uh, are we going to want to be on this track here? Yeah, this is the one we want to be on right here. Well, where's the switch for this track? There it is right there, right? Yep. Here we come. The ethanols, <laughs> due to the crowding here, have been really, they're no longer together. They've been slapped around a bit. They are interspersed amongst the cars. So I was thinking Sean hadn't hadn't unloaded this much already, but evidently he has. And I, like I said, I keep track of it in my spreadsheet, so he definitely has unloaded all of this. So that's good, because I thought we were really in trouble. Now we're just kind of like in trouble, not really in trouble when it comes to trying to get all of this processed. 
I know we're going to get any complaints, though, from Bird's Eye because there's no way they could process the amount we're bringing them now. And they got two more trains full of stuff coming. But I am seriously thinking about sending a crew down there and lengthening that uh, track. Go this way first. Lengthening the track uh, for the unload right here. Moving this up, moving this out of the way. And then just so two cars can fit here. I want two cars to fit here. On the railroad, if I want to lay more tracks, I should be able to lay more tracks. Who am I arguing with right now? I don't know. Okay, so we're going to look onto this Norfolk Southern here. We don't need you. Here we come, folks. Guy smoking out back still. He's been on a uh, break now for uh, over 70 episodes, so evidently he doesn't have a lot to do. We got some sway. We ha <laughs> oh. <laughs> that one came out of I got all choked up about that. Uh, we have some swayage. To the TOFC barge. Sure do use a lot of barges here. These two guys here, were they playing cards or something? Fellas? Alrighty. Did I, did I pick straight ahead first? I did. That's so me. Yeah, here's the barge. See the barge? The barge gets pushed over here, and then they line it up here. Okay, probably should slow down here like a lot. There we go. We'll go take another longer look at the barge. I don't think we got a real good look at it, because I was worried about this. Here we go, yeah. Yeah, so here's the barge. Uh, and uh, see, we got trucks on here now taking these off and parking them here and then uh, these trucks will then take them over here where the crane can offload them right are they doing that yeah see right there they're offloading them here they can put them onto here and we can move them out by rail for the rest of them all right well for our part of the way anyway i suppose wherever they get they probably are going to be put back on trucks again would be my guess okay forward Here we go. This one's already set correctly. I cannot believe we're almost 30 minutes. or We're actually not almost. We're three minutes over the 30-minute mark. Must be having fun. What is this over here? Is, that, is it all those tires right there? Oh, yeah. Look at Pile of tires. It's kind of cool. Kind of like it. It's an interesting way to get away from, uh, you know, making a 3D model. All right, we'll slow that down. Stop it right there. All right there. There we go. Now we're going to back out into this. Pick up these. Here he comes. And then we got our six uh, 
pull hoppers to pick up. Then we'll run this this whole mess up into the inbound track in uh, Tidewater. The upper yard in Tidewater. Actually, we're in Tidewater right now. Uh-oh, uh-oh. Oh. Uh -oh. oh. We hit that one right on the threshold. Look like it right at five. Here we go. Pull out these last two. Canadian National Intermodal. And the last one in the group, Swift. Very nice. Okay, so now we'll come over here. And, yep, where's the switch? We're going to have to clear right here. Where's it? It's on this side. Too far back? Well, there it is, right there. <laughs> it's hidden. That 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 switch is right up on the track, or is it, it's got to be on this side, right? Oh yeah. Look for the yellow posts. There you go. They're protecting the switch, so some truck doesn't run over the top of it. You know how those truckers are. Actually, truckers are a great group of people. I don't mean to throw shade on them. Okay, now we'll just come over here and get this one. I did not uh, ring the bell and or blow the horn when I went across this, did I? We'll do it now. Second crossing here. All right. Here we go. Add a little more throttle here because we got to run back to this one now. Active rail car loading. Warning. Work is being done. Now we're going to run back to the front here. And we're going to go like this. We're going to kill the bell while we do this, though. Uh, this one's loaded, so we don't want to change anything. This one's loaded, so we don't want to change anything. This one's empty. So we're going to say tag at the current vehicle. Just the one, and I want it to be none. We're going to come here. This one's loaded, so we're not going to do nothing. This one's loaded, so we're not going to do nothing. This one here is... Now, they should be empty all the way back now. No. Oh, yeah, because those TFOCs are supposed to be loaded. Okay. So now, from here on out, these are all going to be tagged as none. So, there'll be two cars here. Okay, there's one, two. And there's this one. Tag it. So, I'd like bring you along on a tag ride with me. There we go. Come over here. Tag it. There's three of them here. All for none. One, two, three. Then there's this one. Tag it for none. And there's this one. There's four of them here. These are all going to be tagged for none. One, two, three, four. And there are these. Tag these. There are six of them. Tag them all. None. One, two, three, four, five, six. And then, oh no, not finally. And then we're going to tag these four right here. Is none. One, two, three, four. 
Then finally, we're going to tag these. Uh, the last six coal cars as none. Then we're going to zippity doo da all the way back to the front. That'll make you sick. So we have tie water, tie water, tie water. Oh, no, no. Two tie waters. Then we have none. Then we have the two bird's eyes still. And then everything else should be none. Perfect. Okay. Now we're going to pull on out of here. A little action with the car tagger. And we'll get all these cars out of the way so Jessica can get in here. And then we got to get her process as quickly as we can. So the next person, I don't, I forget who else is coming down here. Suppose I can look it up while we're watching this. I don't know, I don't know, I don't know. Oh, it's, no, that's Jessica. I was going to say, oh, it's Jessica. No, that, no, that already, there we go. It's Frankie, Frankie. He's got some for the coal dock. He's got some for a Riverside Scrap. Harley Brothers. Dole Fruit Dock and Tidewater Steel. He's got it all. I don't think we've ever done anything with uh, the scrap before. Okay. Why we pull out here? Then I can come over here and say, get rid of this from Sean's switch list. That's done. Still working that. He's still work. No, he's not working this anymore. Let's get rid of Fruit Dock, UFC, and the uh, Diesel. Oh, the diesel. I forgot about the diesel. That's up uh, in the upper yard. They want to go up there and get that, that too. Uh, Harley Brothers are done. Box cars from Harley. So we're going to take the ethanol, which he still has three cars to unload, and the bird's eyes vegetables, which he has 13 cars to still unload, and condense his switch list down just to those two items so as to not confuse myself the next time I come down. Organization is key, folks. Now, it does say it's 35 here. Uh, we're doing a lot of swaying, though, and the end of the train is still back in the dock area. I don't think we're going to do anything there. We're just going to we're just going to cruise along here at 16 mile an hour. Seems about the right speed. just far enough over the 15 mile an hour recommended speed limit on the dock that says I respect the rules yet I live dangerously and that's 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 really what you want to strike you want to strike that kind of a uh, that kind of a chord that kind of a balance you don't want to get fired but you don't want the rest of the fellas laughing at you either because you're always driving the speed limit cars in that upper yard. Now, the, the incoming track should be... I just looked at it. Yeah, well, a little while ago, anyway. And it was completely free, so we should be able to fit that all on there. No problema. Now, I gotta yank some of them out. Which ones do I gotta yank out? Okay, so the two ethanols, and then this... Eth okay, these two cars here gotta be yanked out, because they gotta go back down to the dock, and then these two gotta be yanked out, because they gotta go back down to the dock. Alright, so two, then skip one, then two more. That's what we wanna do. Here we come. Up and out of... That's definitely a, an incline there. Uh, that's why uh, Jessica was struggling a little bit. We're coming out of the track lead for the dock. We got a red over green and then a yellow over red. So we're good. Let's go down here. We're going to have to wait now till uh, this is all set correctly. Right? Yeah, all right. We're going to have to wait until he clears this one right here. 
We've got a nice long shot of his entire train as it goes by. Get some good truck sounds. I like it. And of course, once uh, Thomas goes to uh, shunt all of these, that's when they'll be reclassified. That none label will turn to whatever the spreadsheet tells me to turn it into. Comes the end of the train with the coal cars. He's all of a sudden now. I'm afraid he's 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 gonna be so long. He's gonna he's gonna go off into the portal. He's gonna start disappearing on the other end. That would be a disaster. I hope that's not what's happening. Oh, no, we're clearing this one right here. Yeah, not that one back there. And yeah, there's a portal at the end of this track. How close did we get? I don't think... Okay, no, 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 no. Yeah, the portal's way over here. Yeah, the portal's right here. Okay. Woo! Okay, I got nervous for a second. It's all good. Now we're just going to back this thing up. I've done that before where I pull a train in too far and it starts to go into a portal and then it's like a black hole. It gets sucked in there and there ain't no stopping it. So I'm glad that didn't happen. We'll go here, we'll go here, and then we'll go here. Uh, there's no way it's going to be longer than this track, right? There's nothing on here just to make sure. We might as well just play it safe, throw that like this and throw this. Oh, that's already correct. Why not? Okay, but I don't want to be up here. Whoop. I don't want to be out here either. Here we go. Back up here. We're going to grab onto the last coal car. Ride it up till we get onto that track. Because when we get uh, up near the engine, we're going to do a little finagling to weed out those four cars that still have to go back down to the uh, dock. Am I going to drive him back down there? Hmm. I don't know. I do know as, I, as I'm hanging on the end here, I'm going to wave. A wave to the fellas, uh, the guys and the gals in the uh, tower here. How are you folks doing? You all right up there? All right. Good. Here we go. Tidewater inbound. There we go. And then we can stick those four cars we're weeding out onto this track. So we get all the uh, reclassifieds on this track. Then we can uh, pull them back down. I still haven't decided am I going to drive back down there with or my I could just leave him up here right doesn't make a difference I got it in the spreadsheet it's not like he has to be down on the dock plus if he's not down there it gives Jessica just that much more room to do what she's got to do so we're gonna leave him up here we're gonna leave him on the inbound track if another train starts coming in we can always just jump in and move him somewhere else so it's all good That should be the front of the train coming up now here. Up. Okay. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. slow it down a little bit. Slow it down. Okay. I guess I was in the right spot. Go right here. Right here. Right there. That'll do. Because these two here got a bit got to get pulled out they're going back down to the dock they have not been emptied yet into the bird's eye 
ground grill. Go. Where we at here? There we go. Let me click on the engine because I don't want to have to re-click every time. As I cut the cars off, it forgets who I am again. Oh yeah, there we go. This way. I was gonna go over on the other side, then I saw him. switches over. Very good. Now we're going to back it up. Drop these two cars off here. The old covered grains. Right there will do. Apply it. Decouple. Bring it forward. ethanol taker is going to get on the re is going to get reclassified but the two in front of it like I said before are still full they still have to be unloaded at Tidewater Ethanol I forgot who I was. What? I'm on the engine right now. Okay. Continue backwards. I'm going to push these all the way up to the front of the track here. With the coal car. Engines are spilling out. All right. So let's run these up now to this side of the yard. Thomas is that oh there's Thomas right over there there's Thomas he's in the lower yard but he's sitting there on track five we had to get Frankie out of the way Frankie was sitting on track five but we needed it water there on the left. There's that fella. Oh, there's two fellas walking. I thought there was only one. Strolling up and down. All right, 
we're gonna push it past the gantry. Oh, wait. Don't slow down yet. It's too early yet. I'm over here. We'll get him to the old, the old frog. Seems always to be a good place to stop. Frog on the adjoining track. Stop. I did say the frog on the adjoining track, right? Yeah, I missed that. By one. And about a third cars. No, 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 it's forward. <laughs> does it really help to blow it two more times? And maybe it does. He blew it five times. What does that mean? He's going straight up in the air? Okay, there we go now. That'll do. Right there. Now we're going to run all the way up this way. We're going to say apply. Decouple. Forget who you are. Perfect. Now we're going to run back up there and get those two uh, hooked back onto those two green hoppers. There's the KFC. It's taunting me. I want to get one of those buckets they sell that has like chicken mixed in with mashed potatoes. Oh, that's good. All right, so once we get uh, Sean up here and lashed onto these up here, that'll be the end of his turn. And I feel like uh, Tidewater is just not as scary any longer. It's a little scary, though. We still have two trains trying to get on there. Now things have been cleared up a little bit. That's uh, you know, nice. Or maybe it's just me, but it seems like an SD80 Mac is a little overkill for shunting. That's just me. What is this thing got? 5,000 horsepower? Is that what it is? Is that what the SD80 is rated at? I don't even know. Let me look. It's rated at 5,000. Yep. So that's... That's bold. That's what that is. Over this way. Oh, it's beautiful. Nicely done. Why, thank you. up and lash on to this. Then we'll check uh, check the car tagger to make sure that I've got the right cars. I, I'm, I'm like 89.7623% sure that I have the right cars. So, but I'll, I'll check anyway. I'll do my due dil diligence. There we go. Now let's get out so we're not following the switch anymore. We'll move it back to about right here. There we go. That's nice. Oh. Uh, What do we got here? Look at that. Beautiful. The four I wanted to have, I have now. The other ones are up there waiting to be reclassified. You know what we're going to have to reclassify? We're going to have to reclassify uh, the idea that this video can go on longer because it cannot. So we're going to reclassify it and do end the video. 
I hope you guys had a great time. I had so much fun on this one. This was really nice to get down into the dock area and really get some stuff done down there. I feel like I really accomplished something. Uh, why don't you like, why don't you subscribe? Why don't you leave me a comment? And if you think that I didn't really accomplish that much, well, this just may not be the channel for you.